limestone and clay occur together in our quarries at Cape Foulwind. The quarry trucks deliver the raw materials to the crusher, where the rock is crushed to smaller than 100 mm, 4 inches. The raw materials are then stored ready for use. Stockpiles near the kiln where pre-blending takes place. About 80% limestone and 20% clay are ground in ball mills with water, producing very fine, thin paste called solari. The chemical composition of the solari is very carefully controlled by adjusting the relative amount of limestone and clay being used. The solari is stored in large bezins ready for use. The solari is fed into the upper end of a rotary kiln, while at the lower end of the kiln, a very intense flame is maintained by blowing in finally ground coal. The solari slowly moves down the kiln and is dried and heated until it reaches a temperature of almost 1500 degrees Celsius, producing clinker. This temperature completely changes the limestone and clay to produce new minerals which have the property of reacting with water to form a cementaceous binder. The hot clinker is used to preheat the air for burning the coal and the collate clinker is stored ready for use. The clinker is finally ground with about 5% gypsum in another ball mill producing cement. The gypsum regulates the early setting characteristic of cement. The finished cement is stored in silos, then carted to our wharf or packing plant facilities.